But first tonight, North Carolina A&T students have lots of questions after police say they arrested a man with two dozen weapons on their campus. Good evening. I'm Sydney Moore and I'm Chad Silver. Police say Brandon Bentley also had more than a thousand rounds of ammunition and chased campus security guards. It happened more than a week ago, but they're just finding out about it now. WFMY News 2's IT Dace McMiller got reaction from students who are on edge. Nothing was talked about. No alerts were sent. Like, we have an alert system for these reasons. For real? Like, y'all didn't want to say nothing to us. Like, we live here. We stay here. Like, my parents live an hour and some change away. Some North Carolina A&T students are frustrated after learning about some alarming accusations involving this man. Police say Brandon Bentley was on campus with more than two dozen weapons, including guns, a thousand rounds of ammunition, and a machete. Like a part of me is like angered by it because like we're an HBCU campus like hate crimes are a thing. So to think that he was so close to his goal of coming on this campus and doing what he wanted to do and us not knowing a thing about it. Greensboro police say they arrested Bentley after he chased unarmed campus security and court documents say Bentley was afraid and had the weapons as protection from a cult he felt was after him. Documents also reveal he was in a dangerous mental state. If there wasn't no cops out there, he really could have came to our door. I mean, mm -hmm. our dorm with all of those weapons. And, you know, Lord knows what he would have done to us. The university did not send a campus alert during or after the ordeal. And I get it. Y'all didn't want to make a riot or like a foot or a fuss or a commotion. But y'all waited a whole almost two weeks. Until the news broke. Demira Cockerham is a freshman. Us. She said she had her friend walk her to class because she feels uneasy. We have to sit and think at night, oh, we're about, we're going to have to get up and barricade our door with our beds. And we shouldn't have to think that. The university sent us this statement saying because of the quick and decisive action of law enforcement, a campus alert was not issued as the suspect no longer constituted an ongoing threat to campus safety. But I'm just trying to process the emotions that I got from that and just moving on with my day and hopefully um, NC a &T, you know, does something different the next time. Bentley is not associated with a and in any way. He's since bonded out of jail and posted on social media sharing his side of the story, saying he was set up and never intended to hurt anyone.